Welcome back to Market Pros, and let's get right into it. Uh, so we have Solana here. Um, so we did break out of this uh, descending channel uh, line of resistance. Uh, you know, our next level. You know, as we were talking about, once we broke this level, chances are that we were going to come up to this one. That's exactly what happened. Uh, and our moving averages have positive slopes. They're trying to cross bullish over this 100. Uh, and we could come back down for a retest at the 21 at about $90. About $90. Um, and RSI did get rejected off the bullish control zone. But, you know, as we've said before, you know, it's hard to break in. It's hard to break into there sometimes at first. Uh, you know, as you see, it's a common rejection point. So, you know, that's why it, it's a big deal if you can get in there. Volatility is turning up. Uh, as we broke this region, uh, it was very low. So if we can turn up the volatility, get in the bullish control zone and this MACD, which is just got a retest and resumption off, but we are flatlined right now. Positive momentum is waning a little bit. We're not really that far above the zero line. We do have this resistance. Seems like we have some sort of resistance there. Well, no, that was actually a retest. So that actually looks pretty good. Um, and then looks like we had something like this. So basically a symmetrical triangle on the MACD. And that would put us... You know, back up to about here on the MACD, about the 5.58 level, uh, which would correspond with us definitely getting in the bullish control zone and getting up to, you know, about 115. Now, if we do break this 200, my guess is that we do go up to 115, maybe even 115.50, maybe even a wick up to, you know, 118. Um, but first, we got to get in the bullish control zone. We are on the eight hour, by the way. So we're going to zoom in, check some shorter time frames here in a second. So we are up two and a half percent today. Um, right now, it, uh, 200 is holding us down. You know, we did get a slight rejection. We're still operating on higher highs, higher lows, at least on the eight hour. Uh, we need to get back above. And well, I'm just talking about in the short term eight hour because we need to get back above this level. This is what's important. Getting back above this level and getting above that 200. So this level is at basically 103, uh, 103.50 region. So until we do that, I mean, these really are just lower highs, like on the, you know, 12 hour and daily, you know. Uh, so that's, that's the main thing. Let's zoom in down to the four hour. All right. So once again, there's that level we need to break out of. Uh, RSI did get a pretty strong rejection from the bullish control zone. Um, we are coming back down to the signal line. Hopefully it's just a retest. Now, if we do, looks like we have some sort of support right here. So if we do come back down to the 53.4 level, you know, we would have some significant support right there which would probably also correspond with the 50 moving average EMA and this level at basically 88, 8860. You know, we have really strong support right there. So if we do come back down, I would expect at least a bounce from that level. Uh, if not, you know, the actual low. But the uh, 21 could continue to hold us up. And uh, honestly, that would look better. Uh, volatility is turning up, but I mean, kind of barely ranging here in some sort of ascending channel, you know, uh, so volatility still in the lower zone. Um, MACD fresh cross to the upside. Don't worry about these lines now. Cause that was for the eight hour. So yeah, fresh cross to the upside. Uh, positive momentum is decreasing just a hair. But I mean, we just got into the green bar with that last uh, breakout. You know, we, we did have the breakout, retest, and resumption. And this resumption has some pretty good volume to it. So 
right now i mean the eight hour the eight hour looks good besides just making a lower high but we're trying uh four hour looks pretty good let's zoom down into the one hour okay so i mean higher highs higher lows here um yeah i mean it even has a little curve to it you know so if the 21 on the one hour doesn't hold my next guess would be the 50 at 9170 if that doesn't hold come back down to 91 dollars now that still would be a higher low and what we really don't want to happen is we really don't want to come back down here for a retest we already got the retest you know if we come all the way back down here to the 200 i think we'd probably break through this and, and start coming back down and then all that would have been is a lower high on like the 12 hour and daily uh rsi is in the neutral median zone we got a pretty hard rejection from the uh bullish control zone on the one hour we are below the signal line we're above the neutral median line volatility is high macd uh curling back down we we do have pretty strong resistance here now if we come back down for a retest head back up you know the 50 holds us up you know that's going to look really good especially if the volatility stays high and we get a res resumption off uh we want to see these moving averages kind of fan out more you know what i'm saying and that 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 right there could lead us up to that next level and uh yeah i mean that's that's really about it so you know eight hour well one hour looks good uh as long as we as long as those variables that i was talking about come into play you know like the retest on the signal line not a breakthrough volatility stays high rsi turns around starts heading back up to the bullish control zone trying to break through it again and the 50 holds us up and these moving averages fan out which i already said but all right and then the four hour you know rsi once again we'll, we'll just worry about the one hour because uh that's going to roll over into the four hour i mean we are we are working with a fresh cross to the upside on the four hour so that that's good volatility is very low i mean th this really wasn't that much of a breakout at least just yet i mean we do have some good volume on that retest and resumption but you know we'll come back to this see how we're doing so those are my thoughts if you enjoyed the content you know please like and subscribe uh or leave a comment you know if you if you want uh and if you don't like it leave a comment and tell me how i could have done better uh so everyone have a great morning great afternoon great evening and i will see you in the next one